One particularly interesting thing. Although uh, we have no internet data, the Google Maps on my smartphone works just fine. The search works and the location works. So that's basically all that we need. These kind Frenchmen I asked for the water. <laughs> he said one moment and he was gone. So I continued the video editing. And right now, he brought me a grapes, whoa, and a bunch of water. Man, that was a pleasant surprise. I am not leaving this country ever. I am working videos on a hot sun. So I thought, why don't we get some shadow? and i did found one it's there it's the the guest house i guess but it's closed it's monday and it looks like the whole area is like tourist oriented which means they work on saturday and sunday but not on monday and that lady behind the tree uh, refused Draw here. She refused to agree with me when I wanted to stay here. So, oh, access denied. The matter here is, I wanted some uh, shadow because working on the sun is a pain. And I was actually happy because there is a table which has a guitar on it and there are also two guitars here and this is my guess very nice anyway I wanted to show you the French uh, electrical wall socket which is different than Italian Slovenian and the rest of Europe but hey you will have to live without that or find it somewhere else Stop. Amazing. Yes, it's very comfortable. So, this is our new friend. What's your name? Speak. Okay, my name is uh, Batinich Alexander. I'm from Croatia. I live in France. I meet a uh, woman today next to my business. I went and uh, I sell some, some box, you know, container box. And uh, I think this guy is amazing because he makes some crazy trip. This guy is amazing too. Come on, come on. And uh, <laughs> I think if you know the life of this guy, you know everything. <laughs> My man. <laughs> So this is two against one for a French man against French woman. French man won. Alexandra also gave me at least this little bar. I think it is a almond. Is it fat or sugar? I don't know. I will snack it right now. This, whatever it is, is extremely tasty. Mwah. Thank you, Alex. Respect. And it's strong. As a compensation for a lady not allowing me to use the shadow, a cosmos sent me a gift in a shape of a 10 centime, I think so, a old French coin, I believe, maybe not, maybe yes, which I found on the other side of this fence. The issue with the lady in the morning turned out just fine. This is her van and this, I believe, is her husband's van. Her husband came later and 
he uh, all of a sudden appeared uh, in, near me. I was there. I was parked there all, all day. So he, he appeared here with uh, two, two big plastic bags and he was picking the garbage from the floor. So I joined him because I like, I like to make things better and cleaning the environment is most definitely on the list of making how to make the world better. So I was, I was parked here and we were picking the garbage all around. Later, I moved my ass here, walking towards the corner, which I was about to mark. Actually, I did a little, but there was yelling behind me. So I turned and people from that garage were saying, hey, I, my guess is, hey, don't pee all around like a dog. And so I went and one guy came out and I went with him inside and they allowed me to use a toilet. And then later that day, I went to pee again. And this time uh, I removed myself completely from this place. I took the road there and continued uh, towards right side and I did the ugly thing there but when I came back there was a black uh, plastic bag full of shit and when I say shit I mean literally shit and full of garbage and I also picked up all the garbage along the road and while doing that I noticed a door hook yes okay so what about 15 minutes ago i had an urge to pee again and so i was about to leave i was the plan was to go uh, to take a ride around pee somewhere and maybe find a place to sleep and the the mm, the man, but the man came out and he waved me goodbye. You're leaving, goodbye. And okay, he's alive, he's there. Maybe I should ask him to use a toilet again because I already used it once. After we picked the garbage on the floor, he allowed me to use the toilet. So he allowed me again, and I noticed there was a hook missing. But this hook I saw. behind the bush on the street so yes I asked him if I can pee again he said okay and then I asked Oi, where is your what's wrong with your hook where is your hook he said it's broken and I said hey I saw it on the street and yeah he uh, went and picked it up and voila we solved something and I also took a pee properly well well I forgot to uh, tell the main point of the story which is I asked him if we can sleep here and he said ask my wife and I said I already asked your wife today once and I don't want to be uh, refused again but they allowed me to sleep here it's a lovely place it will be quiet it's got wooden floor yes, yes wooden floor wooden floor wooden floor wooden floor and it's got a roof, that's what matters most. And a lot of space. All right, we've met this kind guy Hello. who knows something about electric bicycles and his name is? My name is Hervé. I'm from uh, Roquever near, uh, near Marseille. And uh, I've been uh, in Sun Trip since uh, four years. Uh, I made a mini trip uh, in a solar bicycle and uh, I have a channel, a YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is RV underscore uh, uh, Sun Trip. You have uh, many, many videos and uh, just now I uh, finished the last Sun Trip uh, 30, 33 
We want the help. I finished uh, the, the film since, uh, since uh, 10 days.